Hi everyone. Hope you all are doing great. And today we are going to discuss another case law of separation of power and the name of the case law is Asif Hamid versus State of Jammu and Kashmir 1989. So in this case there were two government medical colleges of Jammu and Kashmir whose selection procedure for the session 1988 to 1989 were challenged in the high court of jammu and kashmir on the ground that it was violative of the directions of the high court in a previous case that is joshna sharma and others versus state of jammu and kashmir 1987 where the high court of jammu and kashmir directed the state government that in future it shall conduct entrance examination by an independent body of the state and such body shall not be influenced by any executive in the meantime the academicians will play the role till a statutory body is created now the issue is whether the high court can direct the executive organ to come up with a statutory body well according to article 246 clause 2 of the constitution of india parliament and state legislature they have the power to make any law under the list 3 of the 7th schedule that is the concurrent list the supreme court held that it is not authorized by the judiciary to the government to direct the executive it is a violation of separation of power the constitution gives power to the executive body to make policy and procedure for the admission to the medical colleges in the state and the high court has no authority to direct the executive body therefore the previous judgment was set aside on the grounds of violation of separation of power hope you got an idea about the case please do not forget to like share and subscribe to the channel thank you so much for watching bye bye